Whatever we're dealing with, he won't say his name, is in complete control of Winston, mentally and physically. Luckily for us, it seems to be much weaker than, for example, Zul. More like the possessors you usually encounter. Even so, a non-corporeal, otherworldly possessor is no laughing matter. But for the life of me, I can't remember trapping this one. I hold your world in the palm of my hand, ready to crush it like an ant. Hurry up and get me out of this guy before I lose my patience. You haven't seen the full extent of my rage. Well, if it looks anything like the scared, lost little puppy who nearly wet himself at the sight of a proton pack, then yes, we don't want to see that again. Keep talking, fool. I've reduced lesser worlds to steaming piles of ash. Let me cut in. When dealing with supernatural entities, I recommend taking a softer approach. Now listen up, Nameless. I hate to be a Debbie Downer, as they say, but uh, Winston is extremely crucial to this operation, not to mention a close friend. So, um, I have to let him go. You understand? Separate us, and I'll consider your insolent offering. I was locked inside that trap for so long that I forgot why I even came to this cold, boring vestibule you call life. We'll do whatever it takes to free Winston. Let's get to work, everyone. You keep busting ghosts while we take care of this and we'll keep you in the loop. <laughs>